What's up, YouTube? So, I am bringing you a chest workout. So, uh, first exercise I do for chest is ring dips. Usually do about a uh, set of 10, set of 6, set of 6, just to get a nice little pump going in the chest. Uh, side note is that I also did shoulders during this workout. I just didn't record it. Um, just feeling a little bit tired after the chest, so just didn't have the energy to push through. All right, so next exercise we got here is just some straight up dumbbell flat bench. Um, you guys are probably going to get on my case a little bit because of my form on this one. Yes, it needs work, um, but you know, that's the kind of thing I didn't even realize I was doing. Uh, until I watch this video. So, you know, that's why I'm videotaping these workouts. That's why I'm making these YouTube videos. Uh, get a better look at myself and, you know, how I look during these exercises. And you can clearly see here that I just need to get a better stretch, come down deeper on these. Um, even though this is uh, the max weight I have, which is 85 pounds. So... No big deal. I will make improvements on that, and I did in the later sets that I did for my chest. Uh, because I watched this video right after this set, and uh, I was like, oh, need to drop that lower. So that's what I did. Alright, next exercise that I did was some flies. So with all these uh, sets for my chest, I pyramid them, or reverse pyramid them, so I go the heaviest I can first, and then I go lighter and lighter until I'm hitting about 12 reps, um, and failure at 12 reps, which is what I like to do. So uh, that's just the way I like to roll on these. I get a really good pump that way. Um, I feel like I can uh, just focus and contract the muscle more that way. Okay, so this is the final exercise that I do for chest, which is a set of push-ups followed by a set of resistance band push or flies or whatever you want to call them. They're not really flies. They're kind of in between like a uh, pressing movement and a, and a fly movement. Uh, I do these one right after another in superset fashion. That way at the end of my workout, I can get a really, really deep burn and pump in. Uh, it's what I like to do to finish it off, just because whenever I finish a muscle group, I really like to get a strong pump. So you, here you can see the fly slash push movement that I do for the resistance bands. So, you know, I usually do for the whole workout, probably in between 15 to 16 sets total between all four exercises. Uh, that's what works best for me. I'm probably going to increase that uh, a little bit as my training gets more intense uh, in the following couple of weeks. Um, thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you like this video, please like it. And um, if you're not subscribed already, please subscribe. Thank you so much.